Hello again, Rob Veach from V Paranormal One. Uh, I was on the phone the other day with uh, Billy Tolley, who's the EVP specialist from uh, Ghost Adventures on the Travel Channel, and is also the equipment specialist. And we were talking about uh, EVP recordings. He was actually going over some evidence uh, from an upcoming uh, show. Um, and he was uh, discussing the, the uh, issue of the microphones and bypassing the microphones uh, with a, a shunt diode. Um, so I did a little research on that and uh, there's a doctor, Dr. Uh, Constantine Radiv. Um, he was a German scientist who um, worked with another fellow called Hans Bender and they, uh, who was a parapsychologist. And Dr. Uh, Constantine um, studied uh, parapsychology for many years and he uh, did a lot of EVP work in a controlled lab environment and one of the things he did was uh, he bypassed the microphones and he shunted them with germanium diodes. So I went ahead and I built uh, a uh, prototype, very simple, and I have uh, the schematic um, I'll show on the screen here and uh, close up of this. But well, it's essentially uh, shunting the connection that goes to your digital recorder. So wherever your microphone is, you're going to plug this in like that. And you're not going to have any more audio going into the two microphones. It's going to essentially have zero audio. But if there's an EVP, hopefully it'll come through and it'll come through those diodes, which kind of, they're not microphones, they're really your shunts. They actually will will uh, short circuit the uh, front end circuitry to ground. But it's an interesting experiment to see um, if you get any kind of EVP using this. Because if you do, it's pretty valid because there's no acoustic information going into it anymore. Another question that uh, Billy had was uh, whether you can synchronize two digital recorders. And I did an experiment and I was able to. Um, you start them off the same time, you put a pulse or a control tone there or a hand clap or a clapboard and you synchronize them up in your audio and then you could have your regular EVP recordings going on where you have all the audio information and then you could have the um, the shunted EVPs where you have the diodes shunting it. Um, so I was able to synchronize that and uh, it worked really great. What I use to synchronize is actually just a little electronic clapboard and it just generates an audio pulse and an infrared and a uh, blue LED pulse, but anything will work a hand clap or a clapboard or a, any kind of sound that can synchronize the two digital recorders together. Mm -hmm. Thanks for watching.